Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Breezy in the Cut. Coming back to y'all on this good Wednesday. Um, I got the update on the Pooh Shite situation. And let's just say uh, Pooh Shite held back some information from us. You know what I'm saying? There's a court appearance that he showed up to, and they explained the whole situation. Now, this is what happened. Pusha, it was a situation that happened. Pusha C uh, was allegedly looking for his money, so he went in his uh, he went in his uh, pants or whatever, pulled his gun out, and the gun went off, and it ricocheted and hit one of the security guards at the uh, at the uh, at the club, whatever. So this is what he's locked up for. I know y'all, he lied to us. Said nothing happened, and it did. He was a little careless. This is why I'm telling y'all, let's promote this law that allows celebrities to carry weapons. So, but they got to go through, you know what I'm saying? They got to make sure you got to go through tests. You got to go through certain things to get it, you know what I'm saying? And gun safety should be one of them, and this is why. Because, you know what I'm saying, he needs it. But he needs to know how to use it. You know what I'm saying? Not saying he don't know how to use it, because you know what I'm saying? If you listen to his raps, he tell y'all he know how to use it. But obviously, he's still prone to mistakes because when he went, I guess it went off, hit the dude in the leg. Now all he pretty much worried about, like I told y'all, he wasn't gonna be in there long. He wound up posting bond for that, and then he got another court appearance um due to another case that's gonna be either tomorrow or if I'm correct, the day after. So he's going to be good on that. He's going to be out soon. But, you know, he just got to be more careful, y'all. And, you know, of course he had to lie to us and tell us that nothing happened because, you know, trying to save face. Like, you know, he want to he keep it on the low. I'm not going to tell y'all the truth. Yeah, I, the gun went off and I hit it, hit security guard. You know what I'm saying? Now the cat's out of the bag. He probably going to probably gonna speak on it. You know, but... That's basically what happened at the KOD situation where uh, Pooh Shiesty and, oh yeah, he's also banned. And he probably gonna have to face a little lawsuit with the security guard. You know what I'm saying? He paid a little hefty little lawsuit. So, you know what I'm saying? Everybody wins. You know what I'm saying? Pooh Shiesty get off. The security guard don't gotta work. Another day in his life. And we get to hear more music. So, that's the update for that, man. Um... I don't know what else to uh, say on this. Uh, if let me know what y'all think, man. Like you know, uh, you think he got off too easy? Maybe you know what I'm saying. But when you got money, that's what happens. You know what I'm saying? Like it's hard for us. If we do something, that's that's not gonna happen. We're not majority of us is not coming with two paid lawyers. We be lucky if we have a pro bono lawyer or a legal lawyer that actually cares. So. We don't get this treatment, but that's 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 what it is, you know, and yeah. It's your boy Breezy in the cut. Come see y'all on this Wednesday with that quick update. Um, I'm gonna come back tonight with some more some more info on the D thing situation. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna talk about that a little bit more and little dirt and OTF situation. Like and subscribe. Shout out to new subscribers. We finna turn up. The whole summer on game one.